टेन अपॉन एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस टू अपॉन एक्स माइनस वाई इज इक्वल टू फोर एंड सेकेंड इक्वेशन इज फिफ्टीन अपॉन एक्स प्लस वाई माइनस फाइव अपॉन एक्स माइनस वाई इज इक्वल टू माइनस टू ना बोथ दी वेरिएबल्स एक्स एंड वाई आर देर इन अ सिंगल टर्म बोथ दी वेरिएबल्स आते हैं बट सी दिन एक्स प्लस वाई Here also we have x plus y. Here we have x minus y. In the second term, here also we have x minus y. Two new equations, so that two new terms, so that denominator is same. Hai. So here you can take one upon x plus y is equal to y, and one upon x minus y is equal to y. And the substitution. Upon the two equations, so that substitution means one upon x plus y will be y, and one upon x minus y will be y. So here we write let one upon x plus y is equal to y and one upon x minus y is equal to y. Now first equation will become ten y. So one upon x plus y. Nothing is there in the multiplication with ten is. Well, the thing is there means one is there, so we can return it as one upon x plus y. That is equal to y. So this is ten y plus. This is also this two remains as it is. The thing is there is the multiplication of two. That is one. And we have one upon x minus y is equal to y. So this is ten y plus two y is equal to four. This is first linear equation in two variable, and the second equation becomes fifteen y. Minus five n is equal to minus two, and we will get the second equation two. This is first linear equation in two variable. This is second linear equation in two variable. And now you have to simplify this pair of linear equation in two variables using any method. You can use substitution method, elimination method, or you can use determinant method also. So here we use elimination method. The coefficients of n in both the equations are equal. We have to make them equal. Here, the equation in the equation two, the coefficient is five. In the equation one, the coefficient is two. So we have to, if you have to make the coefficients of n equal, then you have to multiply equation one, this equation, by this coefficient. And you have to multiply the second equation by this coefficient of n. Means we have to multiply equation one by five and equation two by two. After multiplying equation one by five and equation two by two, you will get the coefficients of n as equal. So we will write here: multiply equation, multiply equation one. By five and equation two by two. So multiply equation one by five is ten into five fifty. Y plus two into five ten. Y is equal to four into five is twenty. Represent it as equation three. Now multiply the equation two by two. Fifty two is thirty. Y minus five two is ten. Y is equal to minus two into five minus ten. Sorry, minus two into two. We multiply equation two by two. Two two is four, and this is equation four. Now in equation three and four, we have the coefficients of y as equal. Coefficient of y in both the equations are same. Here we have ten. Here we have ten. Now by adding these two equations, we can easily eliminate. Yen and we will get the value of yen. So here you can write adding equation three and four. Adding equation three and four. Equation three is fifty yen plus ten yen is equal to twenty. Equation four is thirty yen minus ten yen it is equal to minus four. This is plus ten minus ten gets cancelled. Fifty m plus thirty m that is eighty m is equal to twenty minus four is sixteen, and m is equal to sixteen upon eighty, which is equal to one upon five. Sixteen minus sixteen is sixteen minus eighty.
value of m one half of one. Now putting this value of m in any equation, in equation two, one, two, three, or four, you will get the value of m. We have to put this value in any equation, in equation one or equation two or equation three or equation four. We will put this value in equation two. One upon five, we will put this value in equation two. So you can write here putting m is equal to five. Putting m is equal to one upon five, not five, in equation two. Now equation two is fifteen m minus five m is equal to minus two. Fifteen m minus five m is equal to minus two. We have to put one upon five in place of m. So this is fifteen multiplied by one upon five. Minus five in as it is, it is equal to minus two. It's five under five. Five days are fifty. Three into one is three. Minus five in is equal to minus two. You can transfer this minus five in to the right side and minus two to the left side. So the equation will become three plus two is equal to five in. And you will get five in is equal to five. In is equal to one. We need the values of m and n. M is equal to one upon five, and n is equal to one. But the solution is not yet completed. So the question is not answered. So we have to give the values of x and y. So we x and y are going to be equal. So we have to substitute the values of x and y. So we have to substitute the values of x and y. So we have to substitute the values of x and y. So we have to substitute the values of x and y. So we have to Now we substituting the values of m and n in place of m we have to write one upon x plus y in place of n we have to write one upon x minus y so here you can write three substituting values three substituting values of m and n in place of m we have to write one upon x plus y that is equal to one upon five and In place of n, we have to write one upon x minus y, which is equal to one. Now, taking cross multiplications, x plus y into one is x plus y, that is equal to five, and x minus y multiplied by one, that is equal to x minus y, and one into one is one. We didn't get the values of x and y directly, but we get. Again, we get linear equations in two variables. If x plus y is equal to five and x minus y is equal to one, this is a pair of linear equation in two variables. And you can again simplify this and get the value of x and y. For example, when directly the substitution of the value x and y is equal to zero, when you talk about directly x and y is equal to zero, then it is a reason only. For example, when the one substitution of the one variable. आता इधर एक आठ सब्सटिट्यूशन में दो नहीं फिर ये बोला है वन आप वन एक्स प्लस वाई इज़ इक्वल टू यू और वन आप वन एक्स माइनस वाई इज़ इक्वल टू यू दो नहीं चाहे दो नहीं फिर ये बस एक आठ सब्सटिट्यूशन में आज लगभग डायरेक्ट रिवाल यूज़ नहीं मिलता आप ये ला पहले तो एक तरह ही रिप्रेशन You will get the value of x or y, and then putting that value, you will get the value of another variable. So here we will represent this as equation five. X plus y is equal to five. This is equation five, and x minus y is equal to one. That is equation six. Okay. X plus y is equal to five. This is equation number five, and x minus y is equal to one. That is equation number six. Now adding these two equations. Equation six. 
सिक्स पुटिंग एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री इन इक्वेशन सिक्स इक्वेशन सिक्स इज एक्स माइनस वाई इज इक्वल टू वन एंड हियर वी हैव टू पुट एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री दिस इज थ्री माइनस वाई इज इक्वल टू वन नाउ ट्रांसफर माइनस वाई टू दी राइट साइड एंड प्लस वन टू दी राइट साइड इस थ्री इज इक्वल टू वन प्लस वाई ट्रांसफर वाई वन टू दी लेफ्ट साइड यू विल गेट थ्री माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू वाई हियर वाई इज इक्वल टू so you can write three four minus two is the solution of given equation. 